You can't tell me that don't look good. Hey, y'all, what y'all doing? Nothing. Come on in this kitchen. Let me show you how to make this sweet potato cinnamon roll cake. It's fall, y'all. First, you start off with three cups of all-purpose flour, one-fourth teaspoon of salt, four teaspoons of baking powder, add your cinnamon and nutmeg and pumpkin spice if you would like. I don't measure that. One cup of sugar. Go ahead and whisk that together very well and then put that to the side. Then you get your wet ingredients together. I have two cups of sweet potatoes mashed, cooked and mashed. I have one and a half cup of milk. Go ahead and whisk that together. Well, I'm whisking it because I don't have a mixer. I just moved, so just bear with me. I'm using elbow grease, y'all. Then after that, you go ahead and add your uh, tablespoon of vanilla, two beaten eggs, and then you whisk that together as well. Then after that, you start incorporating your flour. Incorporate it one cup at a time, at a time, and it will start to thicken up, and it's okay that it's getting thick. After you have incorporated all your flour, go ahead and add a half a whole stick of butter melted and you whisk that in as well. Put it in the pan, put your oven on 375 and then you're going to warm it up. Then you're going to add flour, two tablespoons of flour, sugar, cinnamon and butter. You're going to mix it together and then you're going to dollop it on the cake and then you're just going to make swirls all over the cake. After that, sprinkle some cinnamon if you would like. Go ahead and bake it until it gets golden brown for about 35 minutes. After it cools for maybe 5 to 10 minutes, go ahead and make your glaze and then you just pour it all over. Y'all, this thing is so good and it's not overly sweet. The flavor is my love language. I love y'all. Hope you enjoy. Bye.